right, guys and gals, we're out here in an undisclosed location with Randy and Andy. We're going to check out some of these beehives. They've been gracious enough to let me mentor today, and we got a real bee operation here. So just let you get a good idea. They're all suiting up. We're going to check several of these, some that got new queens. But he's got a beautiful place here, and we're going to get a look at some bees here. So stay tuned, and we will... And do beautiful, some bee work. Beautiful hives. They are beautiful hives, aren't they nice? Yeah. yeah I like the bee mobile the best, <laughs> with the yeah, smoker on the best. He cheats on this too. No, we can't do that. This thing is like a goat. He can back in in the tightest little spots. What was that called, Randy? What kind of truck? Mini truck. Mini truck. Mini truck. <laughs> That's all right. Don't you? Don't you get me one of your? Uh, frames you got yesterday let's replace a couple of these okay 14. you got your got your frame i gave you too randy yeah. try one of them black frames now randy all your bees are the carnies correct mm -hmm. yes and no carnies and italian carnies and italians and eventually they get mixed up eventually okay okay this he's trying to draw this wax out and he's got two, almost too many of them for her likings, for example, this one. That's why I had the feeder in there. Well, that's, that's why he put the feeder on. Now, if he wants this in the kick, okay, it's already drawn out about 80, 90%. They put honey in it. The queen wants the place to put her eggs. The bees, they want the place to put their honey. So the bees are beating the queen. They're putting the honey in. They're competing for that reason only. This side they ain't done much. Yeah, and since, well, okay, right here, it's similar to that, but this side right here, is, they, they, they're doing a little bit of both. So that's okay, but if it was one that, let, uh, Randy and I would, uh, we'd take this out and put one that's ready, got wax drawn out and all she has to do is start laying. So Randy, we're looking for the queen on this one? Mm. Yeah. Looking for uh, safely hatched. So this is a newly in introduced queen in this hive? No. That's, that's, qu that's queen cell. Had queen cells. Oh, had queen cells. So we're looking for... We put queen cells in it. Gotcha. So we're trying to see the queen okay. is hatching and is laying, right? Mm -hmm. So it'll be a virgin, uh, virgin mated queen? Put it back. Put it back. Most, most people <laughs> will start about the third frame over, okay, okay. and uh, keep them row on the queen. And uh, for us to speed up, I cheat, I, I start here over here. We just want to know if she's there. Gotcha. We don't have to see her, we just see her results, her eggs. Just see her eggs. Yeah. There's a frame right here that had the eggs in it. With this white, uh, background, you can't see larva as well as you normally can. Randy, is so the a, black foundations, you can see it better there, right? Well, I'd rather have the tan. The tan? Like that over there. But see, this is almost, almost white. Most of his earth frame is called plasticell, and they don't have this metal. This is almost transparent. Gotcha. Look at it. See how it's transparent? Almost like a mirror. Oh, yeah. I don't like it uh, myself. But you just, you, we got mixed and match whatever we get. And uh, many times uh, people come in and they'll have this, this frame and we, we, we have to take them frames out and put new frames in with, with a nuke, put a nuke in. And sometimes we end up with extra frames that we normally don't buy. I get the privilege of this one too? Go ahead. One of these two. That's where the queen's gonna be. I hope you're right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and many times we're in a hurry, I, I jump right on them, but I don't want to roll a queen. I'll show you other people. 
Now, and again, what am I after? I'm looking which is the easiest one to pull out of there. Okay? And if you do it right, just don't don't pull left, right, and just and sometimes I get one to come up. It's like this here. See how much harder this would be to get out? You got they got this done, and they have maybe another one, another one. So I stay away from them. These you things. Got any queen cells on your bottom? Huh? Okay. This one had queen cells. I didn't look. No, it had queen cells on your. Oh, he no. did. No full frame. Oh, you here? I'm gonna show off a frame of honey here. There we go. They're working at it, aren't they? Oh, look at that. Yep. That's almost close to being capped. <laughs> Third hive, cracking the inside here. But when I'm in a rush, I just go into it. But Randy and Irma Cook, they like to get inside here. But there's so many bees, they don't make a difference. Where you go, you could roll a queen. If she's laying, she will not be here, okay? Okay. She's already laid there, so it's the best place to get them out, in my opinion. She'd be laying over here and over here. So how can you roll if, if she's not there? That That's my assessment to it. And then looking down the side, uh, you can see no difference. Let's reach it back in. Yeah. This, this, now the sad thing is, you see how many bees we see here? You ain't gonna see no more bees on any hive, but she made zero honey so far. And see I'm running around with chicken with the head cut off? I don't like that. I got eggs. I see I see brood there. My eggs too. Oh good. Yeah, they just need more time in. She's okay. doing her job. Okay. Where's she at now? Right there she is. There we go. We got her on video now. Got a blue dot. This year's queen. <laughs> this is one he purchased and brought in. Carney queen. You see the little crown on her head there, Andy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's a big queen. Hey, YouTube, here's ECP. Just finished working my own bees. Wasn't able to video it, but as I'm leaving, I'm standing about six feet away from a young crow. Must have hatched out early this spring. Not sure if it flies real well yet or not, but about three feet from it now. Thought that was kind of neat. Nature abounds. Say hello, Miss Crow, or Little Crow. Pretty neat. Wildlife's everything. Y'all take care.